Hey, what's going on guys? Nick here with a news update coming straight from D23 Expo in Anaheim, California. So this is regarding the MCU and the Avengers Infinity War first footage that was shown exclusively for the crowd inside at D23. So basically what we have is a detailed description of the first footage slash teaser trailer, whatever this is going to be officially classified as. It's unlikely that this will be released to the public, but there's a chance that maybe they'll show it again at Comic-Con and they might decide to show it then but as for the description it starts off with Mantis and the Guardians flying in the Milano and you see teenage Groot in the seat up in the front and a body lands on their windshield and it turns out to be Thor who's kind of sleeping and not really all together. His hair is short just like we see in Ragnarok and Rocket Raccoon is startled by this. Mantis is actually the one that wakes him up and Thor is startled that he actually ran into their ship. The Guardians basically look at him and he asks who they are and that's when they tell him they're the Guardians of the Galaxy galaxy then the ship zooms off through the cosmos. So the next bit of footage just kind of goes through quick cuts of different characters. We see Wanda Maximoff dodging something as it breaks through a truck. Loki stands in ruins presenting the Tesseract to somebody. Peter Parker's spider sense takes off as he rides on a bus and all of his hair stand up. The footage zooms in on his arm as his hair stand up so that's official confirmation that he does have his spider senses. And then we see Tony preparing for battle in his Iron Man suit and he's in space with the Guardians of the Galaxy. The footage then jumps ahead when Thanos is saying, fun really isn't something one considers when balancing the universe. This does put a smile on my face. The Guardians observe ruins in many different places around the galaxy, Thanos warps into a new world, and then we get another shot of some quick action stuff where Star-Lord's battling Thanos, Doctor Strange is also battling him, we see Spider-Man in his new Iron Spider outfit from the end of Homecoming, and he's also fighting him at the same time, Winter Soldier jumps into the battle, and Wakanda readies their whole army to defend their territory. Then we finally see Captain America step out of the shadows and he's fully bearded. We see the Hulkbuster armor fighting. We see Wakanda fighting against four-legged creatures from Infinity, the comic book series. And Thor's head is squeezed by Thanos. And we see Thanos beating down on Iron Man and the Guardians of the Galaxy. All of them are defeated and Thanos has assembled his Infinity Gauntlet. He then throws energy from a hole into space. So that's where the footage ends. It sounds pretty amazing. I really wish that I could have seen this firsthand, but overall, for the description I'm really loving it definitely everyone who saw it said that it's on a scale that's never been seen before in the MC which is obvious because I mean they're dealing with like 60 or 70 different characters and tons of different nations I mean you got Wakanda fighting creatures and all this kind of stuff going on and I'm, I'm just can't wait to see what's going on with this movie and what's next for the MCU and especially seeing all of the characters come together finally you know Iron Man alongside the Guardians of the Galaxy Spider-Man in his Iron Spider costume and all that stuff should be pretty awesome on the big screen but leave your own thoughts down in the comment section below. Are you guys hyped up by this footage? What's your hype level at right now? And are you excited to see the first stuff from Infinity War when it comes out later on? As always, thanks for watching. My name is Nick, and for more on the MCU and Avengers Infinity War, subscribe to Hybrid Network.